guys, welcome to another show day vlog. This is a big one. ETA British Finance. It's also the expo, it's the first expo they've done. So um, yeah, we're gonna see what it's like. Oh, I can already see a familiar face, Mr. Mr. Matthew Smart. Oh fucking legend, get the door here. <laughs> <laughs> nah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, good, good. So, really simple uh, registration. Literally took two minutes. Number seventy-eight. Number seventy-eight. Number seventy-eight. Will it be the winner? Seven number? and eight. Seventy-eight. <laughs> um, really, really professional looking. Like they put loads of banners up. Telford International Centre looks decent, to be fair. Um, but what I'm really impressed with a free T-shirt and a little goodie bag which is pretty cool so yeah um it's now half past nine and i've got about an hour before the show starts so i've got a few check-ins to do so i'm going to go back to the car get the check-ins done um and then i'm just going to chill um i think i'll be on about half past 12. um so yeah i've got a bit of time to relax i'll probably wander around the expo because the expo hall isn't absolutely huge um so you can see a few people already seen some familiar faces so it should be a good day message me if you need anything at all but you are honestly absolutely smashing it i always look forward to checking so keep it up and i hope you have a lovely weekend <laughs> perfect Oops. little perfect little work set up there i like it yes yeah, it's, it's decent isn't it <laughs> it's like you working is it <laughs> <Got nails. laughs> it's the joys of doing your own tan I had to do it outside in the car park. <laughs> the little top up will be arrived. But uh, I think it's dark enough. Not going to really know until, like George said, until I'm up against other people. But uh, it's always a hard one to judge. But previous shows have been okay. And we opted for a slightly darker tan this time. PCA top coat's always really dark. Because PCA is always really dark. So yeah, we uh, went for a super dark um, coat and we put on an extra one. So hopefully all will be okay. Here she is! How are we doing? Hey. You good? Yeah, you're good. Yeah, good. Excited. How cool is this venue? Yeah, it is. It's really cool, isn't it? Yeah, really big. Well, I was the hardy end, just when you crossed the road and walked it. And the act was actually decent. I don't know why I think we're back safe for that. I'm staff, mate. Big staff. Coming up, all men's physique complaints as backstage. The show is due to start in the next few minutes. Thank you.
in second place. Guys, how are we doing? It's a few days later, um, so we just walked around the expo. We had a really nice time. We socialized with some people, networked, um, bumped into a lot of familiar faces. Um, PCA, wicked, wicked finals. Honestly, that was one of the best bodybuilding shows I've been to. Uh, I've been to quite a lot of shows, so hats off to PCA. And it wasn't just because of the placing, you know, irrespective of the placing. The organization was really good. The backstage pump up area was absolutely awesome. Um, so yeah, yeah, a lot of respect to PCA for that. It was a good show. So it is now the following Wednesday. Uh, literally, we got back from the expo. Uh, we did have a meal that night. Well, I had a meal that night. G's still, you know, digging hard. Um, and then straight back to prep for me because we are competing again this weekend. Uh, people probably think I'm crazy, you know, this another show. But yeah, that's, this is the second to last show. So I'm almost there now. Um, so we are going to be at NFM this weekend. So this will be basically the next episode that comes out. Um, we've got two clients competing, got G competing, and I'm competing, doing classic and men's physique. So it's going to be a good show. It's going to be an interesting show because um, basically there's a couple of PCA pros that are doing NFM. So even though, you know, PCA finals, you thought, you know, that was a really high standard. This shirt NFM is going to be higher because I won't be against amateurs. I'll be against PCA pros there because uh, basically it's a thousand pound cash prize. So it's attracting some high level uh, athletes there, which is fine because I want to be compared against, you know, good level athletes and see how I stack up. So once again, no expectations, but I'm looking forward to the show. Um, recap from PCA. Obviously, it was a wicked result for me. Second place in the UK absolutely over the moon i was only expecting well i was only hoping to get a top five call out so to get that uh stacked lineup i'm very very happy and it's given me a little bit of belief in myself as well which is which is really nice um feedback i didn't really necessarily agree with their feedback because they said a condition was a strength of mine and delts was a weakness if you swap that around i would understand because on stage i think delts was one of my stronger things and I lost out on first place to Dylan because Dylan was leaner than me. Like I was bigger than Dylan, but he had more condition. So, you know, it was a deserved first place for him. Um, that's where I could improve. So I haven't really listened to PCA feedback. I'm, you know, I had friends in the audience and they agree with me. Like condition is where I lost out on first place. So that's, that's the negative of only having the 13 weeks to prep for the show, you know, although this is the leanest I've ever been, this is also the highest standard I've ever gone against. So that's why I need to be even better, basically. Um, so yeah, I've gone straight back to digging this week to try and come in a little bit more shreddy this weekend for NFM. Because um, as I said, it's gonna be a more leveled up uh, stage again in terms of uh, athletes I'm against. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. And then um, after that, we've got two weeks until the last show of the season which is again, the biggest one. So as we've gone through, the standards got higher and higher because that is 
the IFBB Pro Qualifier in Alicante. So, you know, going to be against some of the best amateurs in the world at that show. And I'm really looking forward to seeing how I stack up. So, going to leave the video there. Um, once again, guys, thanks for watching. All the support is amazing. I've got a lot of messages on Instagram and I really, really do uh, appreciate it. Um, so, yeah, tune in for next week's episode because, as I said, it's going to be a client episode again. Uh, we've got Steph doing bikini and Diva. We've got Georgia doing the pro show um, because in the NFM you have to do the amateur in the morning. If you get your pro card, you can do the pro show in the evening. G is already a pro, so she's just doing the uh, Diva pro show and the bikini pro show. The cash prizes are for the pro show, so we all want to try and get to that standard. We've got Sean doing um, uh, Masters Men's Physique and Open Men's Physique, and then I'm doing Classic and Men's Physique. So it's going to be a really busy day, but we're really looking forward to it. So yeah, we'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching and see you next week.